What's up guys? This is Big D. I am the Grim Gamer and I am the Grim Rider. Back with my weekly stream. Hey yo, it's Suave Beardson already jumping in. Thank you. Appreciate it very much. Uh, this stream is my fourth and final stream of my collaboration or, um, you know, um, I had the word I heard, right? Dang it. Um, my crossover, excuse me, uh, my crossover of the Grim Rider and the Grim Gamer. So, um, for those of you that may come across this later on the Grim Rider channel, and are interested in seeing more gaming related content, then I urge you to head over to the Grim Gamer channel on YouTube. There's a lot of content over there, and you can always join me every Tuesday night at 11.30 for these streams as they go live for more gaming content. With that being said, this is another motorcycle related game. Last couple weeks we've been playing... Uh, Excuse me, you've been playing um, a couple streams of American Chopper. And since this is my last stream for my crossover between the two channels, I decided to do a different game. This, you see it right here on the, that way, excuse me, on the screen. This is Road Rash. This is the original Road Rash for the Sega Genesis. And this game was originally released in 1991. And it spawned an entire series of games, uh, had several sequels, uh, made it to a couple different consoles. There was at least three different road rashes on the Sega Genesis. There was a couple on the PlayStation, and even one made it to the Nintendo 64. Now, this one is not one that I played a lot, I don't recall. I mean, I played it a few times. It's not like I'm a stranger to it, uh, but... The one that I'm most familiar with was released in 1994, and that one we had on the computer when we were kids, uh, but apparently they released a version of that game in 94 on the PlayStation, so at some point, I may actually look in to get me a copy of that one and uh, playing through that one. Uh, that one sounds like fun, and when we were kids, we also had a Road Rash Jailbreak, and that one was released on the PlayStation in 2000, and to best of my knowledge, it was uh, basically the last mainline title in the Road Rash series, and this entire series has been dead ever since. So over 20 years ago since we got the last Road Rash. Uh, there was a um, spiritual successor, as they called it, um, called Road Redemption, came out in 2018, but I've never played it. Um, I heard nothing but bad things, actually, uh, about it, and so I never gave it a chance. But getting back into Road Rash, I'm thinking, you know, I would like to get a couple of the old titles. I'd like to get Road Rash 2 and 3 for the Genesis. I'd like to get the PlayStation 1, the original PlayStation release, Road Rash, and maybe even Jailbreak, just to kind of, you know, nostalgic purposes. Check that one out again. But if I'm going to do a bunch of them, I feel like I need to give Road Redemption a chance. Um, so that might happen at a later time. But for right now, the time being, again, uh, this is the original Road Rash from 1991 on the Sega Genesis. I'm going to jump into this. And um, I don't know how long this game is, and I don't know how far I'm going to get. But since this is going to be a one-off, I'm going to try to get as far as I can uh, in this stream. So um, I'm going to turn some audio back up here for myself turned it down as I was doing my intro and I turned the music off for a moment uh, just so that I can get through this introduction but I'm gonna do this and actually put um, put my name in here so a to nope I need to go back and I went too far I'm gonna try to just put my name in here quick Um, there should be some kind of space or something in here. Hello? There we go. Alright, get rid of the rest of these pesky letters here. And uh, this game doesn't save your progress or nothing, but it gives you these passwords. And um, every so often, 
uh, you know, you want to want to check out your password because if uh, you lose all your money or something, you basically got to start over again. The password is the way for you to not have to do that. So, bam, there we go. Big D, starting on level one. And there's a certain button I can hit to get my music to come back. Um, it's not A, B. There we go. Get my music back on here and get that classic Road Rash sound going. You gotta do that. So, this game, this original Road Rash, only gives you five courses. Um, but the courses get longer the higher levels you go. So, these ones here, like this one, Sierra Nevada, this one's 5.6 miles, Pacific Ocean, 5.3, and so on. Level 2, I think they go up to like 7 miles, I think level 3 goes up to 10. Uh, again, I don't know how many levels there are, but um, we're going to jump in here. So, I guess we'll start right here with the uh, Sierra Nevada. Let's jump in. Oh, and I should have read that. I forgot there was a screen there. And... Ugh! Get out of here, rude boy. And again, we got the, uh... We got the cheapest, lamest... Oh, he got me. He got a shot in there. We got the cheapest, lamest, slowest bike in the game, obviously, to start out with. But we got to get some money so that we can get some better bikes and, um, you know, do a little better. But I should be able to win a race or two here, at least in the very beginning, regardless, as long as I don't screw up too bad. Blow by these guys here quick. And if I wasn't trying to concentrate so hard here, um, we at least got... Whoa. We at least got our, um... Miles per hour, I'm guessing that's uh, kind of like a... Uh, see, in here I'm trying to look at other things. I'm not paying attention. Um, but like an RPM gauge, that little 07 right there is our position. Oh, 08 now. Um, gives us our bike health, our individual rider health. And uh, the opponent that we're closest to, whether either they're close to us, uh, in front or behind us. That guy was dread. This one up here is Lester. He can just get the hell out of the way right now. So, since I've already crashed... Whoa! What's up, guys? Get out of here. Um, we may not win this race right from the very beginning. We might not, uh, might not be starting off too well. I do have to really pay attention here. It's uh, currently in fourth, though, so I guess it could be worse. Woo, just whipped right by those guys. Second place. First right up ahead. All right, we might have a shot at winning this one after all. And uh, down below the speedometer, uh, well, in the speedometer there, you can see the miles actually going up. So, like, uh, it's at three point something right now. That actually gives you uh, an idea of how much longer you have to go in the race. So, again, this one was like 5.6 miles or something like that. So it kind of gives you an idea how much further you got to go into the finish line. Uh, I can't even tell you how long it actually took me to try to, to actually figure that out. <laughs> um, but just some trial and error and uh, just trying to pay attention to what different things are, I was able to finally figure that out. Seen a comment there. I'll have to look at that in a second. But listen to this soundtrack. The soundtrack kind of rocks, and each... Each different level, or each different race, uh, gives you a different tune, which is kind of nice. Oh, let's not hit that. But a couple of these tracks actually uh, slap, as the kids say. Listen to that. All right. First race, first win. I'll take it. That's, uh, what? I think 750 bucks. Yep. So, we started out with $1,000. That gives us, uh, $1,750. And that right there underneath, uh, would be the, uh, password, uh, to write down to, uh, basically, you know, keep your progress going. So, um... Yeah, no. Um, when I first plugged this cartridge into the Genesis, uh... I'm thinking, oh, man, Road Rash, hell yeah. And I start playing it, right? And I'm like, 
No, I... That's not the one I remember. If I hit the C button... Yes, this will actually take me to the different bikes. But yeah, so this one is... Not... Not the one that we had on the computer. Uh, at all. So... But this is the one we start out with. This 400 pound bike's got 60 horsepower. Pretty lame. But then they go up in price. 90 horsepower, 450 pounds, 5 grand... 7 grand, 8, 12, and it goes all the way up to, yeah, 2,500, or 25,000, excuse me, for the 150 horsepower Diablo 1000. Um, we got a long way to go until we get there. Um, next bike is 5,000, but I think I can actually get quite a ways with the starter bike, so if I save up for 7,000, I might be able to bypass that one altogether. So, uh, and then there's another button that takes me up to a high score screen. So, obviously, I've only earned 750 bucks. But, um, throughout the entire playthrough, and however much you earn, you can actually try to get up higher on the high scoreboard. I see old Sergio down there in fifth. Didn't realize Dandalinger actually played this game. And anybody that doesn't know, um, I do a, um wrestling series over on the Grim Gamer channel, and one of the characters is Sergio Dondalinger, so just a little uh, shout out to that character in that series there. So first in our first race, so uh, not a bad start. Pacific Coast is next, and this one was what, 5.3? Yeah, the Linger, that's right. O'Leary, he's actually one of the police officers that shows up every once in a while, so... Now take it easy and don't let me catch you speeding. I, well, I can't guarantee that. See, this I think is one of the, this right here, I think is one of the uh, tracks that I like the most. It's a pretty rocking track. Get out of here, grub. You know, I mean, for 1991 Sega Genesis tunes, Get no complaints out of me for this one. I tell you, uh, not too long ago, I actually turned the music off uh, in the main menu, and so I had no music in the race. And let me tell you, there are not very many sound effects uh, if you don't have the music on. <laughs> um, kind of like the old uh, like NASCARs and stuff at the time, where the engine has like one sound when it's shifting through the gears, uh, the bike. Sounds pretty weak as far as shifting. <laughs> um, so it's like, nah, I, I think we we probably need to keep that music on. That's just probably a good idea. I think, I and I, I don't remember right offhand. Um, I'd actually have to look into it or just play it again. But I'm, I think... Road Rash Jailbreak was the only one where you had a couple different, you know, types of bikes. And I'm mean, not, like, just different bikes, but... In this one, of course, you only got the Rockets. And I'm pretty sure it was like that for almost all the Road Rashes. Um, but I think Road Rash Jailbreak actually had some, like... Not necessarily Harleys, but, you know, like, cruising-style bikes and stuff. And, um... Whoa! Um, and so I, I got a question for the motorcycle riders out there. Um, if you ride a rocket, just, I'm curious to know, how comfortable is that really? I mean, I don't, I mean, I ride, but I don't ride, you know, the rockets. Um, yeah, get out of here, Shiva. Um, I ride Harley Davidson's. I've got a couple different ones. Um, and they're the big ones, too. You know, the, the baggers. Um, and that's just what's comfortable to me. And so I asked that question because at one point, uh, I was riding with a couple of guys that I work with. And they rode a couple of rockets. And, and uh, I went to a local bike shop. And that's actually where I bought several of my bikes over the years. And uh, they, they were like, hey, you know, I actually sit on one of these, you know, rockets. And... See how you feel. I, hey, I didn't. I wasn't paying attention to the length, but right there's another win. Hell yes. Um, 
But anyway, so I, I sat on one of these rockets, and I'm thinking, I don't know, A, how y'all ride these, let alone, how do you get back off it? I couldn't even figure out how to get back off the bike because of how you practically laid on it. So, yeah, I'm just curious out there, you know, if, if, if you do... Um, you know, ride a rocket. I mean, to each their own. As long as you enjoy it and, you know, and you're riding and whatnot, that, that's fine. You ain't gonna get no beef from me or nothing. Um, but just how, how is that comfortable? <laughs> um, I like to be able to, you know, flick on the cruise, kick my feet out and just ride, you know, and just the rocket, I just, I couldn't even get off it, let alone ride the thing. Uh, Christmas being the most annoying sound of the, yes. Yes, actually they do. If I were to turn this music off and do a race without the music, just the sound effects are a little annoying. <laughs> ain't, even, ain't even gonna lie. So it's like, nope, nope, we're gonna have to keep that on. So two races, two wins. Um, I don't think you necessarily have to win every single race uh, to move on to the next level, but I do think you have to finish at least in the top three or four. So um, two wins. Off to a good start. We're going to go to the Redwood Forest. Uh, Biff, you don't have to worry about me fighting dirty. I'm a sportsman. So if we see Biff, we don't necessarily have to punch him in the face. Um, I read somewhere at one point that depending on how you ride with the other riders in the game depends on how they ride with you. So, some of them are aggressive, and you actually have to pay attention to which ones those are by name. And some of them are going to be aggressive with you, like, out of the gate. But there's some of them that they'll have, like, that little um, text screen. And if they say, basically, that I'm a sportsman, that I won't mess with you, if you actually get up to them, you don't start punching them in the face or kicking them or whatever, then they'll actually kind of just let you pass and leave you alone. I didn't realize that... You know, the gameplay, see like, oh, nope, he tried to, he tried to get me, that's Axel. But I wasn't aware that, you know, the AI was, um, had that kind of depth to it. Um, some of the later Road Rashes actually had several weapons. Uh, you know, clubs, chains, and whatnot. This one, um, only has the club. That's the only weapon that you can get in this version, uh, you know, this early game. Um... And apparently some of the uh, later ones, too, I think Road Rash 3D may have been one of them. Or maybe it was Road Rash 3 even on the Genesis. But you can actually accumulate different weapons and actually cycle through them as you ride. Um, so that's kind of neat. But in this one, you only get the club and you have to steal it from another rider. So you have to time that just right, too. Like, if you ride up to somebody, they go to hit you with a club. If you hit the punch button, you can take it right out of their hand. Get out of here. Oh, that was Biff! Uh, Nastasha, I think she's another one that you don't really want to mess with. That she'll be friendly. Because she's got a tech screen in here somewhere, too. Dude! Shiva. Get out of here. Uh, Alright, second place, and we're four miles in. So we got a little time to try to catch the first first place. Oh, I didn't even see that car coming. Total wipeout. Oof. I hear sirens, too. We might, uh, we might have company here in a minute. Well... Now we're, what, like 4.7 miles into this race? Pretty sure winning, that's not going to happen in this one now after that wreck. I just totally didn't see that car coming over the hill. Get out of here, Shiva. See, uh, see how well I can recover here. Oh, yep, there's the cop. It's O'Rourke. Oh, can I get third? Nope, not quite. Couldn't quite get third. Uh, only 200 bucks for fourth place. Got a long way to go to get to, what was it, 7,000? Yeah, 7,000. Oh, wait, actually. So 2,700 is what I've won, but I actually have 4,700. So, all right, I actually got a little bit more than I thought. How many races? There's, um... 
There's only five races in each level, but I don't know how many levels there are. And at least in this original first game, um, it's the same tracks in each level, but they just get longer. So when I get to level two, I think they go from like five miles to like seven something miles. And then you actually have faster riders to race against. So the AI gets harder and the races get longer. Uh, riders per race. I think there's 15 um, riders per race. We're going to hit Palm Desert here and we're going to find out for sure. But I think it's 15. Yeah, there's Nast uh, Natasha. Natasha. Should listen to what Biff has to say. Great guy. Okay, I'll remember that. So, starting in the very back here, um, yeah, so there's 15 total riders in each race. And as the levels go up, the AI gets faster and harder, and the races get longer, even though they're the same tracks. So, you gotta buy faster bikes, and, um, you're gonna have more hazards, too, the longer the, uh, the race goes. There's one of these courses, I don't remember... Get out of here, Gunta! Uh, one of these courses, I don't remember exactly which one it was, but if you don't watch, there's like cows laying in the middle of the road. You hit the cow, if it's standing up, you crash. Oh, I stole his club! Hell yes! Oh, I get a chance to... Eat. Listen to that sound effect. That just sounds deadly. Um, but what I was saying is, uh, like, if you run into a cow that's standing in the middle of the road, you crash the bike. I think if it's laying in the middle of the road, you jump off it like a ramp. Uh, I can't... I don't know that for fact in one of the other courses. I think I saw a deer on the side of the road at one point, so you can run into them. Ooh, got him. Ooh, got him. Oh, yeah, having the club is awesome. Oh, wait, is that Biff? We don't want to mess with Biff. Gotta remember that, unless he swings at me. But nope, he's not gonna. He's gonna let me go. Get out of here, Slater. Woo! So yeah, that's um, that's interesting. The, the 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 more I play this game, the more little details I find out about it that just make it even better. Say that again. There's another soundtrack. Shiva, Viper, you can get out of here. And that's, oh, that's Natasha, so we don't want to mess with... Hey! Hey! Try to kick me, seen that. Uh, what are we in, second? Oh, okay. Second, and we're what, four something? Okay, we might have a chance at winning this one. Get out of here, Viper. Tasha, give it up. Woo! Alright, leaving them behind. Oh. Uh-oh. Come on, where's the finish line? Oh, here it is. There we go. Take another win. Hell yeah. Another 750 bucks. Takes us up to almost... We could get the Panda 600, but again, I think as long as I keep winning, I'll save up for the, the Banzai. That's a neat little feature too. Each course has a different like little clubhouse area or some little uh, graphic at the end when the race is over. I think the later games actually had like a little animated thing, uh, like crossing the finish line or something. Whoops, that's that was the wrong button. All right, so the last one that we have is Grass Valley. If I win this one, even though I got fourth, it might still let me go to level two. So, Grass Valley. There's Slater. I was way loose that last race, man. I saw my race flash before my eyes. Whew. Yeah, Slater. You, uh... Pro I think you wiped it there, buddy. Bam, bam, bam. Get out of here, rude boy. 
Actually, I think I heard this song in one of the other... Oh! Oh, I remember that. So maybe there isn't a separate song for each track, but I thought there was. But a couple of these tracks I still really like. It's just classic Road Rash sound, man. Axel? Back off. We got here Hammer. Hammer needs to get out of the way. Whoa! Whoa! What happened? Well, uh, well. All right. Not really sure what happened there. Hmm. All right. Back in 13th. See how well we recover here. Hammer! So that one corner actually might have just turned too sharp. If you stay turned too sharp for too long, I think he does just wipe out. Look at that air. Whoa! Jumped right over that guy, whoever that was. I do find it a little interesting, though. Like, you don't really even hear the bike at all as long as the music is on. But if you turn the music off, you can actually hear the bike. I gotta look it up, and I don't remember exactly which one it is. Might have been Road Rash 2, or it, I think it was 2. That you could actually, they included like a story mode, like split screen, so you can actually play two players at the same time in race. Which that sounds like that'd be fun to have a, a second player, you know, riding alongside you and everything. So if I can get me a copy of Road Rash 2, I ought to play that at some point. Alright, so we made our way up to 7th, but uh, time's running out here a little bit. Get out of here. Oh, I stole 4th! Okay. Alright. Well, um, that could have been worse. Oh, nope, it's going to let me go to level two. You're pretty good. Let's ride with the next... Oh, I didn't even get to read that whole thing. But yeah, so now I get to ride with, um, you know, a different group. So they're going to be faster. And see, now this one's 7.7 .7 miles. 7.8. 7.9. So now the tracks are going to be longer. And the opposition going to be faster. So, um, let's start out with the Pacific Coast and see how well I can do. Please don't drive so fast. The Sarge is getting upset with you people. Eh, get out of here, O'Leary. What kind of name is that? Brulumbiga. Oh, I see you kick me. You must be out of your mind. So I'm not sure if I can necessarily win against these guys with the faster bikes, but I'll still get money for placing decent, and that'll still give me money towards the $7,000 bike. Dude, get out of here. All right, so we're up to eight. Whoa, that was close. I think I could have reached out and touched that car. Get out of here. 
see like I'm gonna be fighting for um, mid pack here. It looks like. Oh no! Well, all right. Like we took each other out there. That sucks. Uh-oh, a couple guys got wiped out here, it looks like. Make up a couple of those positions anyway. Sixth, all right. Oh, shoot, that was Biff. Shouldn't have kicked him. Oh, well. I'm trying to win. jam out. Oh, no! There was nothing I could do about that. Nothing at all. Oh! Well, then. All right. So much for that progress. Playing this one really, really wants me, uh, wants to make me go out and get a copy of that PlayStation Road Rash and uh, play through that one again. Because uh, that one on the computer played quite a bit. I, I seem to recall as kids, and that was so much fun. Oh, that guy had a club! Is that the Biff with a club? You trying to bash me, Biff? You about to Biff it, man. Up to fifth, okay. Oh, see the cows! Cows! Another cow! <laughs> Actually, I think that was the same one. You said that was the bomb. You talking about that old computer one? Gonna let me go by? Yeah, not even gonna take a swing. What we got here O'Leary. Oh, that punch didn't even phase him. Oh, oh, did you see I hit the cow and it didn't act as a ramp. <laughs> rampies, cow rampies. I'll take fourth. I'll take fourth. Um, it could have been worse. They get fifteen hundred bucks if you win. All right, how much do I got now? Six. I still need uh, almost another grand. All right. So fourth in the uh, Pacific Coast. Let's try Grass Valley. Don't slam everyone, amigo. No points for bailing. Okay. Then uh, stay away from me. <laughs> Didn't listen to me, did you? The punch seems to work better than the kick. Bam, 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 bam. Dude? Telling you, you better back off it. Oh, one guy wiped it. Whoa, that's a good way to lose two spots right quick. Yeah, already this bike don't really don't really want to compete with these guys. Gonna have to upgrade for sure. I'm 
might uh, might have to do a couple races here uh, where we just don't do so good. Just collect the paycheck, collect the money. Dread? Shiva? Out of here? Okay, hold on. I'm gonna pause here quick. Uh, I played Twin Snakes when I didn't go in for the hard world record. Dude, go for it. Um, anybody watching this, Suave Beard's in there. Uh, he is my brother. And um, plays a lot of um, Twin Snakes, speed running. And um, he's actually done fairly well. He's actually in second place overall in the speedrunners um, for several different difficulties. And um, what was it just yesterday? Did a, his first hard mode um, attempt and already got second place. <laughs> so um, it's not bad. It's not bad at all. Uh, also does a, a lot of playthroughs of a bunch of the other Metal Gears over on his YouTube as well. So check them out if uh, Metal Gear is your thing. All right, what are we up to? Seventh? Eh. Gonna need a few more spots in that. We need some money here. Biff? Whoa! Whoops, I didn't mean to do that, but, uh, well, here we are. Whoa! Whoa! I'm gonna stay on the road here. Okay. Six is might. That might be the. Best are gonna get in this race. I just can't catch anybody else. Man, that's the thing. The longer these tracks get, like the curvier and hilly they get towards the end. Oh, there we go. Take fifth at least. Take fifth right at the end. All right, that'll be a couple bucks. Ooh, 360. Oof. Yeah. I have to probably do a couple more of them to get the rest of that 7,000. Problem with that is, is if I end up wrecking the bike or actually get, like, stopped by the police and have no money left, then I basically start all over again. So that would suck. Palm Desert. Let's go with the Redwood Forest. I'm tweaking. If I see Dread, I'm going to take his club and liberate his head. <laughs> okay. You do you, Slater. Oh, that dude just took right off. Dude? Oh. Rex? Well. Oh, we gotta get some positions here. Oh! Oh, he got a lucky shot in there. Whoa, 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 son. I'm going to need you to back up. Man, 
Nashville back in ninth? Lame. Cop! Ugh! So O'Leary? Why don't you all uh, give O'Leary here something to do? Oh, and I took the club! Hell yeah! Whoa! Whoa! Oh, come on! <laughs> You're the cow as you run into him. Okay, well, I uh, I definitely thought I was going to get clear of that car and was just going to turn back in front of it, but... A little lapse of judgment there. And that's going to cost me big time. the road. Oh, there, there was a, uh, oh, there's a couple deer right in the middle of the road. I'll take third because of that. Thank you very much. Now, as long as I don't screw up. Bucks. Could really use that right about now. Woo! Just whipped right by him. That first and second just left me behind. Oh, that, that corner almost got me. I was not expecting to cut back that fast. Aw, oh, I don't... I didn't even get a chance to use my club. That's bummer. But there's 600 bucks. And... Yep, I'm 10 bucks over. I might... I... Whoops, that is the wrong button. Bam. Oh, we get trade-in credit for the other bike, so I didn't go completely broke. Oh, that's good. Well, that's neat, so... All right, so I got some money to play with then. Next bike is the Kamikaze at 8,000. Or the Sh... Shuriken? For twelve thousand. Oh, I know, right? The problem is, though, I don't think you get the trade-in credit um, for the other bike until you buy another one. You have to have the money to buy the other one first. But now, now I got a better, faster bike. See if we can go out and win another race here. Uh, be fast. That is the best way to win. Duh. Let the rest fight, fight amongst themselves. Ooh, one punch. All right, now that uh, I went two bikes up and not just one, so Let's see if we got the speed here now. Back off. Looks like we got a little speed. Ooh, 
Whoa! Reaction time just has to be on point. All right, up to six. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, already the cop trying to ruin our fun. Whoa! Okay, um, that worked out just fine. Get out of here. Up to second? Okay. Oh, there he is. First place, right up ahead. Come on, can we get there? Actually, I forgot that this is the longer track, so we're only four miles in. Shoot, we got time. Flying though. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Get up there. Not the tree. Oh, and the car I didn't see coming. Damn it. Oh, that sucks. Uh. Well. Can't believe I only lost one position out of that, though. That's kind of crazy. Totally ate that guy's dashboard. How in the hell did I miss all of that? I don't even know. couple more spots, why not? Damn. <laughs> them, them curves are just... They whip around one way to another so quick, it's like, I can't even... I don't even have time to react. Eighth. Out of all that, end up with an eighth. Gross. That's terrible. First race with the new bike and get the worst finish I've had so far. <laughs> All right, Palm Desert where it's at though. Right here's our first win. Right here. Especially if I knock everybody else down. Up to eighth, right quick. Yeah, oof is right. Horrible. Oof.
no, 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 no. Whoa, whoa. Why are you gonna put a, a jump like that and a curve right at the end? Why are you gonna do that to me? Oh, up to third? Okay. Any of the gamers out there try to come up with something to talk about here a little bit if you're um, watching this on a live stream replay or anything like that feel free uh, on either channel Grim Gamer or Grim Rider feel free to drop your uh, comments down below when you watch this um, but Sega Genesis anybody out there actually owned a Sega Genesis what would you say would be your favorite game on the system just curious. Boy, this bike still seems like it doesn't want to catch up to the last one or two. I have to say, my, uh, my favorite games to... Oh. Uh, yes, I was just about to say that, Beardson. My favorite game on the Genesis would still probably have to be Kid Chameleon. We, uh, we didn't have, uh, Mario and all that stuff growing up because we didn't really have the old, uh, Nintendos. Um, but we had Kid Chameleon, and Kid Chameleon still to this day is awesome. And at some point here on this, um, Twitch channel, I will be getting to some Kid Chameleon fully intend on that, for sure. Oh, come on. Well, this, um, this level has just not been kind to me at all. Come on, turn. Back to six. Lame. Woo. Oh, and that was the end. Fifth? Damn. Wow. Okay. Yeah, we are not ready to move on to level three yet. That's for damn sure. We got to try to get rid of this eighth. That's garbage. What? You want to start talking smack, Natasha? Wait till I see you. It'd be like broomstick over here laying on the ground. Well, we're back to 8th. It's where we finished last time. We gotta do better than that. Shoot, I figured with this bike moving up basically two bikes. Um, <laughs> I thought I'd be uh, whipping these guys. Uh-oh. Get out of that guy's way. So, Beardson, does uh, seeing this at all make you want to go back and play some Road Rash? <laughs> does, uh, even though this one is the original on the Genesis, it's still a blast. Would like to go back and play the one that we had. Um, 
Might even have even more fun with that, but this is still awesome. Angel, you just tried to kick me? You must be out of your damn mind. Oh, I figured that was gonna happen. Damn it! Trying to go around one of them curves with a car on the opposite side of the lane. So you got the car to worry about on the one side, and then you got the, the signs in the corner on the other side, and it's like, like you're you have such a very limited space to try to get through there. No, well, already crashing. Back down to fourth. Lame. Corners and curves, are you kidding me? Well, even with the crash, I've somehow made it back up to second. I have no idea how, but I'll take it. Let's see who we got up front here, Butch? Butch needs to come on back. Or he needs to hit that car right there or something. Which didn't happen. Ah, cop. Get out of here, O'Leary. Whoa! Look at the air. I think that corner got me last time, too. Hey, I'll take second. That's fine. Shoo. A rough. A thousand bucks, though, for that. A thousand for second? All right. Need eight thousand to get the kamikaze. Kamikaze's only an extra five horsepower for eight grand, though. Hey. I feel like we need this sh sh shuriken. All right. So, we got a couple fifth place finishes here. So, let's try Grass Valley. See if we're going to prove... Prove my standing there. this bike in level two still isn't really like seems like it's good enough to win Whoa. 
They're right there, but I just can't catch them. Come on, just a little further. <laughs> Get a punch in there at least. Still can't catch first place. Oh, there we go. Yeah, there we go. Now, where's the finish line at? I need the finish line, like right now. <laughs> Come on, come on, come on. Oh, I still got like another mile or something before the finish line. That sucks. Oh, Leary there's gonna try to ruin my day. Look at these curves, are you kidding? What the hell is happening? No! Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it! Oh! Look, at what, 7.5 miles? What is the finish line right there up at the house? Wow. Ugh, it sucks so much. Yep, right there it is. Crap! Damn, man. Alright. Let's try Palm Desert. We got a fifth place there. Try to improve that. had that win right there in my hand, man. One corner took me out. Whoa! Whoa! Easy! Viper. Goodbye. We got here the Biff. Goodbye. And of course, O'Leary here to ruin our fun. About got wiped out. He about caught me right there. I'm actually curious to know for uh, some of the gamers out there. I've always been wanting to play some more motorcycle related games. The problem is, it seems like I can't really come across too many. Um, obviously, there's this entire series. Um, there's the American Chopper that I just played. There was a sequel to that. Somehow that game warranted a sequel. I don't know how the hell that ever happened. Um, my favorite, I would have to say, motorcycle related game. It wasn't necessarily a motorcycle game uh, at first, but it had a whole DLC basically designated to it. But if Grand Theft Auto 4 had The Lost and Damned, which actually might be my favorite, um, just because it actually had characters, story, all that stuff. Most motorcycle games I seem to find, they're just all a racing game of some sort. So if anybody out there knows any other motorcycle related games that I could try, please let me know, because um, I'd like to find a few more, and I'd like to play a few more of them, if, uh, if they do truly exist. Whoa, that was close. 
Like, I heard uh, of the one was like, what, um, Ride to Hell or something like that, but I heard that one was broken as hell, garbage, basically doesn't even work. So, not to even waste my time, and yeah, let's take out that sign too. Why the hell not? Because we were doing good. <sighs> um, so yeah, just curious to know if there's any other motorcycle-related games out there that are actually worth playing, because I would really hope there would be. All right. Well, that dude just wiped out on that, on that car, so that's neat. Um, third. Okay. Days Gone was awesome. Um, was really hoping that they would do a sequel to Days Gone, but I don't think that's gonna happen. Unfortunately. Oh! Oh! Alright, I guess my finishes are good enough to warrant going to level three. So, if I couldn't barely even win a race in level 2, I'm sure I'm about to get my ass whipped, but, you know. Alright, level 3. These are now 10 mile races. Start right out with the Pacific Coast, and, uh... <laughs> Let's see here. Ten miles. Ooh, Slater just ate it. I came across on eBay some time ago. It was actually a Harley Davidson game for the PlayStation 2 called Race to the Rally, I think. But that looked like it was it looked like it was sort of like a road rash. You gotta like race other bikers to certain points and whatnot. But I'm like wondering, how good can it really be? Because uh, it's pretty cheap on eBay these days. So I don't know if it would be worth it or not, but figured, well, maybe if it is cheap, I mean, hell, I could just pick it up. And if it sucks, I only, excuse me, I only spent a couple bucks. So how good or bad could it really be, I guess? But again, ugh. but again, that's more, that's more racing. So it's like, I don't. Like, I don't know what else is there as far as a motorcycle game. You feel like I need to play it? <laughs> Hold on. Uh, oh, okay. Um, Ride to Hell was a fan of Bonner Lee's. Worst video games ever, I feel. Oh, so you feel like I should play Ride to Hell? That, um... I don't know, dude. <laughs> um, oh, come on! So you got me you, trying to tell me I need to play Ride to Hell. It just makes me want to ride into oncoming traffic. You see that? And if I do that again here next to this cop, then I'm going to get busted. And I don't need that to happen. Um, yeah, I don't know, man. Ride to Hell, I don't... I don't know if I really want to waste my time with that. Because I heard it was a steaming pile of hot garbage. Whoa. Whoa. Wouldn't mind trying maybe that, that Harley Davidson game for the PS2, but I don't know about Ride to Hell. I, that might be a that might be a little too much suck for me. <laughs>
Oh, I'm not even halfway done with this race yet. My bike's got less than half of its health left. That sucks. Seventh? I feel like that really sucks where it's like this bike still didn't seem like it could compete with uh, level two. So I'm gonna have a hell of a time. Whoa! Almost ran that dude right over. But he shouldn't have been laying there. But, uh, yeah, gonna need a lot more money to get better bikes. I feel like here in stage three now is where, like, the grind's gonna start coming in. Damn it all! I'm gonna end up ruining this bike's what's gonna happen. I just need to get to the end here at this point. Don't even matter where I finish. I just don't need a don't need to wreck this bike. Let's try again with the next race. Stay ahead of that bike. This bike just can't compete. Oh! Oh, that was way too close. Well, there's the finish. Seventh place. That is terrible, but at least I didn't total the bike. 420 bucks. Yikes. Road rage. Okay. Road Rage? I've never heard of Road Rage. I wonder if that's any good. Oh, so seventh for my first race in level three. That is just awful. Let's try Grass Valley, I guess. It's 42 story missions or 50 side missions ranging from delivering escort jobs to combat raising all oh, gang brawls, open world race fight, and also be through the ranks of say Oh! Um, I'm gonna have to remember that, and I'm gonna have to look into that and see how much uh, copy of something like that's going for these days. Dude, can I just slow down on me like that? real quick. Oh, come on. Ugh. Turn my chainsaw strapped to her back. What? It's on PlayStation 2 for a digital copy. 20 bucks? That's not too bad. I mean, I've spent 20 bucks on worse things, I guess. Oh, 
Uy. All that just to be a ninth. Ew. Oh, come on. <laughs> 26 out of 100? Yeah, I mean, what do critics know anyway? It released brand new for 30 bucks? Okay. I mean, obviously not a triple A title, huh? I don't know. I might look into it a little bit. Oh, damn. Well, this is just not going well at all. <laughs> My bike a mile away? Good lord. Yeah, sure, we'll just hang out back here in 12. You know? Alright, 13th maybe? Really? Really starting to struggle here? Oh, come on, man! I'm gonna end up trashing this bike here at some point, I swear. Still got about half the race to go and this bike's about trashed again. I can barely try to even get through the races. He just touched me, just wiped me out. Okay. Sure, why not? Back here fighting Biff for 11th. It's just disgusting. Complete disgrace. Oh, and I'm wrecked. Damn it. Oh. Wow, alright, so my bike needs repair. 700 bucks. That sucks. So a seventh place and wrecked. So level three is going swell right now. Let's try the Redwood Forest. Then so we can go right up the middle between these guys. Got a shot in there, okay. Oh, he just kicked me into the sign! Are you serious? Wow! Alright, cool. Just hang back out here with Slater back here fighting for last place. <laughs> yeah, the difficulty ramped up 
quite a bit from level 1 to level 3. What the, what the hell kind of curve was that? What was that? Basically nothing. Yeah, I was afraid of that. I really was. I mean, again, there's a whole bunch of racing games, whether it's super bikes, motocross, whatever. But as far as anything aside from that, it just seems like it's just not a very big genre. Everything I can to fight for scraps back here. <laughs> oh, whatever, dude. This much difficulty. Holy crap. This game Legion does false sense of uh, badassery right at the very beginning. Basically, I just rip off wins right after another, and now here. Uh, so, uh, two levels later, we're gonna humble you quite a bit. Just gonna proceed to kick your ass over and over and over again. <laughs> the way that they did these roads, it seems like they made it to where purposely. You feel like the road's gonna go one way, and then it just cuts to the other side. Even that, uh, come on. If I go back and rewatch that, I swear I had space between me and that car. Like, on the right side to get around it. That, that seems like bullshit to me. Again, are you serious? Wow! Another 700 bucks. Actually, hold on. I might need to like write down this code here. Because I go any further than this, I'm going to run out of money and I'm going to have to start over again and I'm not about that. money and not gaining it. 
which is what I need to move along forward. <laughs> Damn it. <clears throat> I gotta just take the brunt of my anger. So out of the three races so far in level three, I finished one of them. <laughs> in seventh place, no less. <laughs> so I can at least finish this race here. Good God. Oh, he had a club. I should have tried to take that. Whoa, what happened to you guys? Why are you going so damn slow? I think he just got wiped out, so that's cool. Okay, yeah, sure, why not? So you guys could have hit them cars, you know. Give me a chance. <laughs> Stay on your side of the lane, will you? Okay. Chip. Whoa. See another, I think another comment popped up on there. Give me, give me just a second. Ooh. Oh, I th damn it. I think I keep getting that corner too or something. I don't know how many times I've wiped out in a tree, in a corner, just like that. something in the road. What the hell? They don't want my second. I was in second. I would have taken second over these last couple races I had. Shit. No. Moose had to ruin it. 
how do, how do I how do I try to avoid that when I can't even see it coming? Get a bit irritated. And come on, dude. <sighs> Try to go around a car and then curve and a sign. Uh, well, yeah, there went third. What the hell? And that's the finish line. You see them waving the damn... Oh. Oh, dude. <laughs> ah! <laughs> They're waving the flag right there. Serious? To bone to bass moose on a motorized bike. Didn't see it coming either. And then I get wiped out right there before the finish line. Like, oh. So, alright, we got a sixth and seventh. <laughs> Good lord. Oh, I got got the club. Now, now, now mess with me. Get out of here. Start dropping bots. Yeah, come on up here. Angel, you don't want a piece of this. Oh, a couple cars, that's great. See that? That was almost an X up. <laughs> oh, that to bone served up cold right there. I'm gonna buy a game station. Listen, I'm sadly I'm I'm thinking about it because I think it would be hilarious. Um, it sounds so bad that it might be hilarious, and I might just have a good time because of it. They'll go through a couple hundred games that are complete trash. <laughs> Could uh. Do a couple different streams just going through several of these, you know, BS nothing games in the game sta uh, the, the hell is it? The game station? Uh, you know, go through, I don't know, let's see, in a two and a half hour stream, if I even did like ten minutes per, per game or something, I'd be able to get through quite a few of them. Ah. Yeah, just hanging back out here in ninth. Dude, 
Are you serious, man? <laughs> oh my goodness. Say you, I just need somebody to beat with this club. Dude! Look at, look at these curves. Like, how am I supposed to react to that? <laughs> Ridiculous. One on one side of the road, one car on the other side of the road. You gotta try to ride in between the middle of them with a split second decision. It's rough, man. can say after um, after playing this for what looks like maybe about an hour and a half or so now one thing about uh, you know this old uh, Genesis controller here um, no joystick so having to you know do all this turning with this d-pad here um, starting to wear on the thumb here a little bit <laughs> Well, this bike's about to be totaled again. There's a finish line. At least I ain't got to pay to fix the bike again. Damn. Making very little headway, though. 360 bucks or something each time. Next bike's eight grand. Don't even have six. Oh, yay, yay. We have an eighth, a sixth, and a seventh. It's disgusting. Disgusting. Ah. <sighs> Kick you in your shin right quick. Just because. Oh, really? Yeah, I don't know. I don't like the kick. The kick doesn't seem to work as good. anything that time.
traffic is getting ridiculous. Oh, get out of here. tell you guys frustration really starting to set in I can't finish a race for nothing keep losing money so I'm never gonna get a better bike like this ever about these old games though this grindy and like the difficulty how much it increases from like one level to the next is just insane into the tree. Mm. See, look, it looked like that corner was going in a, the opposite direction. Again, got me again. So I guess I could try using a brake every once in a while. Why in the hell would I want to do that? <sighs> Wait, hold on, let me go back. This here is crisp handling with good power at high RPM, but no mid-range. So, in other words, I just said something about, you know, using the brake. No, don't use a brake. Just rev it to it red lines, and that's where you're going to get your best speed. That's where you're going to do the best. Just don't ever brake. Not ever. <laughs> so with this Redwood Forest is the only one I haven't placed in yet, and my best finish is sixth. Yikes. Don't eyeball me, bud. I want a little respect, you hear? Man, O'Rourke, shut the hell up.
Ugh. Dude, get out of here. That was Biff, too. Try not to mess with Biff. And he just kicks your wheels right out from underneath you. What a... What a guy. What a guy the Biff is. and a busted damn you damn you damn you six hundred dollar fine oh. and I was just I was literally just thinking to myself well at least I haven't gotten busted yet I need to just stop thinking apparently <laughs> out of here. Otis? Deer. He said, whoa, and then there's the sign. Miss the deer, hit the sign. <laughs> oh, yeah, no, just y'all can just run me over too. It's cool. <clears throat> mm, 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 mm. <laughs> and I gotta get. I seen in the, in one of the screens there. I got to get fourth place or better in every race in order to move on to the next level. And so far, my best finish is a sixth. Ugh.
Oh, you got a shot in there, didn't you? Totally just wiped me out. Are you serious? Oh, Man, busted again. There goes another six hundred bucks. Damn. <laughs> this one is the only one I haven't placed in yet. Busted what? Two or three times now on this on this one course? It's terrible. me out again again wow wow they're just kicking my ass I'm almost out of money too holy crap man Showing no mercy here in this course. miss that car. I didn't have a clue. It's like I should have been right there in the grill. And what the hell? And then I didn't even touch nothing. I didn't even touch anything. Hmm. <laughs> 
So how did anybody ever beat this game? <laughs> I'm just curious now at this point. been up a little bit further, would have gotten busted again. Ugh. That entire intersection was a complete mess. The deer. The deer. Ugh. <laughs> I, uh... I don't know if I'll ever even be able to finish this race. Let alone try to get to level four. Well, with the, uh, the amount of time I got left here in this stream, I I'm not going to make it to level four anyway, but... I just kind of want to finish this race so I can place at least in each one of them. Damn. This one's giving me all types of problems. Back in ninth. Give him a shove right quick. That's fine. Get around that cop as fast as possible. Just try to wipe me out again. Oh, that was lucky. Dear, at least I saw that one. games out there that y'all can remember playing that would just frustrate you just half to death oh holy crap I finally actually finished it 8th place but I finally finished the damn ring <laughs> but yeah just out of curiosity you know is there any of them any game that you can think of right off the top of your head that just no matter how hard you try it just 
infuriated you to no end? Because <laughs> this one's starting to. Well, again, you gotta get fourth place or better in every one of these races. Sixth has been my best so far. Got eight three times. This bike just simply cannot get any faster and get me any further than this. So it'd be all about consistency and grinding and getting some money in order to buy a bigger, better, faster bike. Um, I don't think that's going to happen. I keep totaling the bike. I keep getting busted. I keep losing money. But I got a little time left in this stream. So the best thing I can hope to do is maybe try to improve my finishing positions here in a couple of these races and then uh and then call it so we're trying grass valley here oh he had a club i wanted that club car. The Biff. Oh, he almost got me with that club, too. Got me. <clears throat> Sorry, thought I was hearing something. Navigate. Oh, and again. Didn't even see the car. Didn't even see it coming. Completely blindsided. second 
Whoa, those cars came out of nowhere. So I know there's got to be more <coughs> cars here at some point. Seems like I haven't seen one in a second. There it is. Cow? Couldn't avoid them both. Uh, nine point something miles in. Almost done with this track. Oh, wiped out. Thank you very much. Take my spot back at least. Well, at least improve that one. Sixth. It's still not great, but it's better than the eighth. I'm getting whooped by like over three, about what, three seconds? Like, jeez. All right. So, Redwood, that one just destroyed me over and over again. So, I don't want to mess with that one. And, uh, I was saying about the, uh, the old. Sega Genesis D-pad starting to really sand off the thumb. So even though I got about another 20 minutes I would typically stream, well, I mean, even if I did one or two more races, that might take me to the end anyway. So let's try to improve Palm's, Palm Desert and then uh, see after that. punch him just because I can. Got it! Alright, now. Now, see, and what, what the hell happened? What the hell happened to make that Irritating as hell. Oh, I almost got him. Almost got him. Whoa. Whoa. Double guys. Oh, you got lucky. Lucky. Oh, got Biff before he could get me. some breakage. Breakage. We got behind me. Spike. Ooh, Spike just ate it. It's what you get. It's what you get for trying to take my spot. I'm a desperate man at this point. 
<laughs> Been losing a lot of money. I need money, damn it. Get out of the way. I thought I was catching up to a couple of them too. I thought I seen a few of them, but apparently not. Oh, there they are, way up there. Seventh. I mean, ha! uh, yeah, and still got a long way to go. A long, long way to go. So now the only one I got at eighth is Redwood Forest, but you know what? Um, I'm gonna write this password down. Let's see here. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. One. One, one, one. A. J9Q? Q. Q. Alright. I think... I think that's a good place to call it right there. Um... Did, uh, did the best I could. Got to level 3 in a relatively decent time frame, but man, this bike just cannot keep up. And, uh, it got real hard real quick. And, uh, my thumb is really starting to feel it now. <laughs> so, I think I'm going to call it here. But this, this was a lot of fun. I like getting back into this road rash. And, um, I'm going to look out for some of the other road rash titles. And, because I'd, li I'd like to get into some more of them. And I'd like to do some streams on some other ones uh, in the future. So um, I'm going to keep my eye out for some of the other ones. Uh, again, this was the 
fourth and final stream of my Grim Gamer, Grim Rider crossover. Uh, so I hope you enjoyed it. If you're watching this on the live stream replays, then make sure you uh, hit the like. And um, if you want to see more gaming content, if you're seeing this on the Grim Rider channel, then uh, head over to the Grim Gamer channel. A lot more um, gaming content over there on that channel, and I'm going to continue to do streams here on this Twitch channel and upload those live stream replays specifically to the Grim Gamer channel as well. Um, I got a couple more ride videos uh, getting ready to come out uh, in the next week or two for the Grim Rider channel as far as uh, motorcycle related content for there. And I've got an entire new series getting ready to start uh, over on the Grim Gamer channel. The first episode of that will come out next Monday. And that is a Skyrim series. Something that I've been working on for several months. And is finally able to release it. Come next Tuesday, to coincide with the release of the Skyrim series, I'm going to jump back into the Elder Scrolls here on the stream, but I'm going to be streaming the Elder Scrolls uh, 4 Oblivion game I haven't played in quite a long time, so I'm pretty excited about all that. Um, so that's going to be it for me tonight. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed these gaming videos on the Grim Rider channel, and I hope you enjoyed these uh, on the Grim Gamer channel as well. Stay tuned for more content on both channels. And, uh... Yeah, that's that's going to be it for me for tonight. I am Big D. I am the Grim Gamer, and I am the Grim Rider. And until next time, I will see you guys later.